Hello, my fellow zombie squad. Welcome to the Dustin TV. Hope you're having a happy Friday afternoon. Today's video is talking about why haven't God give us his powers. I can tell you the reason why. This is the story about this. Okay, guys? The reason why God haven't give us his power because he don't want it fall in the wrong hands. Be imagine if people are evil. Be imagine how many innocent lives will be lost because of these people to have God's power. Be imagine. Imagine that. Like for me, for instance, if I had God's power, I would have used them for good. I wouldn't use them for evil. See, God didn't give his power to to humans. He gave the powers to Jesus, Lucifer, and the rest of his kids, the archangels, and angels. But see, life for instance, if God give us the power, we could just heal ourselves or heal, heal other people, our family. There will be no deaths in this world. You have to have death in this this world. That's just what it is. And see, if there were, there's no people have died on earth, heaven will be empty. Hush. Don't mind my dog outside barking, guys. That's what I'm saying, guys. I mean, put it in, put it that way. I mean, there will be no humans up there. You know, God created heaven for his children and his angels to take care of us when we die and go up there. That's the reason why God hasn't given us his powers. Because he knows people, when somebody is dying, he would know you would heal them. They would be like new. No. He knows that. That's the reason why God hasn't given us his powers. Because he don't want it in the wrong hands. Be imagine. Gang members. Uh, even Hitler. Even had the power. Oh my God. Even if Hitler had the power. He will pour, pour more destruction into this world that nobody hasn't seen. He don't just give his power to a random person because be imagine okay imagine this everybody on earth has the power. We be fighting each other for centuries. This world will be in chaos. You wouldn't live your life peacefully. I know the world is chaos right now. Be imagine if every human on earth had God's power. It would be total chaos. I know what I know exactly what I would do. If I had God's power in COVID-19, destroy it. Because this virus is the most deadliest virus we ever had. I would destroy the COVID-19 if I had God's powers. If I had it. First, I would 
make myself different. Like, make my body as a normal body instead of my body is like this. This is what drugs did to me. I would correct it. I would actually would do something. If I had God's powers, I would actually bring back my birth mother, bring back my dad's dad, bring back my dad's grandma, uh, mama, and I would definitely bring back my dad's granddaddy that was killed by lightning way before my dad was born. He died when my granddaddy, his son, was just a kid. I will bring back my dad's grandfather to let my dad see his granddad, granddaddy. And I will bring back my dad's brother. I would have done that if I had God's powers. But you know that's wrong. If I had done that, God would be disappointed in me. Why should you bring back these people are happy where they're at. They're happy in heaven. If I bring them back, they come back to their bodies. And see, you can't do that. That's the reason why God didn't give us his powers. You know, I would, I know exactly what I would have done. Like, if I had God's powers, I would get rid of the rapists, the child molesters, and the murderers. Get them, take them out of this world. If I had God's powers. But guess what? If I'd done that, do you know how, how trouble I will be with God? Be imagine that. God would chew me from the one side to the other. He would actually put me over his freaking knee and put a belt on my ass. Be imagine you're bent over on God's knee, your pants pulled down, and God's spanking your ass for being bad. By God. It's probably three times worse. Because God have one hell of a good arm. And then he'll get rid of my powers. Then he will say, you're not me. Don't do that. You're not the judge and the executioner. God is. You see, I know there's ju judges on earth. Because... The human law, right with God's law, they're both the same. But God never thought they would be a child molesters, rapist. They know He knows murder, because He's seen murder. But guess what? I found out something that nobody hasn't known. Do you know the reason why Lucifer turned evil? Because when God and Lucifer and his brothers fought their sister, I mean fought their aunt, God's sister, Lucifer bare the mark. He buried the mark, the evil mark. That's the reason why Lucifer is where he's at. But see, Lucifer still have his powers. Lucifer, I mean, Lucifer can bring havoc to on earth. He can smash what he calls us God's toys. We're God's toys, but no, we're not. We're God's children. 
But if, you know, if I had God's powers, I would go to toe to toe with Lucifer. Because I know what's right and what's wrong. But well, why should I go up against my brother, Lucifer? Guys, yes, God created Lucifer. God created us. Lucifer is our brother. He's our evil, he's our big evil brother. And we hate him for what he did. I hate what he did, but I still love him as a brother. See, guys, I understand churches, Christians, and all that teach you how to hate Lucifer. But they don't tell you what, what went on. See, God is the light. God's sister is the dark. Do you know God is? Lucifer and his brothers, the archangels, has fought their aunt and put her away. And Lucifer had the mark. That's the reason why he turned the way he did. Think about it. Lucifer was a good child when before he, he got the mark. But, see, if he kept the mark and he vanished, God vanished Lucifer to, from heaven to hell, why did God let him keep his powers? Lucifer still has his powers because he was born with his powers. We wasn't born with powers powers but if we did this world would be in chaos because every man there's a lot of evil people in this world and if they if they had their hands on that power oh my god they would use it to rob steal and have their way with women They would do evil with that power. That's the reason why God did not give us the power. Hold on. Bless me. That's the reason why God didn't give us the power. Because of that. Because of what will happen. God just give us the brain. See, God is happy. He sees buildings that the human made. He's seen technology that human made. Bridges. Ships, trucks, cars, boats, planes. He's amazed by what human created. One thing that God give us is this, our brains, to think and be smart and we can create stuff with our brains. God is not a disappointment. God is not disappointed of us. What he is disappointed of is people breaking his laws. Drugs. Crime. But he knows there's called police officers. Deputy sheriffs, state troopers, FBI, CIA, 
the Marines, or the Army, the Air Force. There's a lot of good guys and good girls in this world that does good things. But see, God don't have to hold our hands the whole damn time of our lives. We're grown. He, what I'm saying, guys, he, he was there when we were growing up. He, God raised us as his children. We are his children, guys. He raised us to be a good person. There's some bad apples in the bunch went to being evil but we have to learn from our mistakes everybody makes mistakes guys God knows that oh, excuse me guys but going back towards the reason why God has to give us the power because we don't need it we do not need his powers. We had the power of our brains to do stuff. Guys, what about the heart transplant, liver transplant, face transplant? That's all because of this. That's all because of that. And technology and science. God didn't make us dumb. That's the reason why God gave us a brain to think. Like like special people like me that have learning disability. We can't learn like a normal person, but we could do other things that a normal person probably couldn't do. We are we have our own thing. What is it, Shelby? My cat just came in. Come here, kitty, 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 kitty. Come here, come here, girl. Come here, come here, girl. You know, I mean, that's what, that's what I'm saying, guys. God, he give us powers. He give us powers, but not the power that he has. He give us the power to think and do what we can do with our minds. He didn't give us no damn mind control. Why do that why do we have buildings, cars, cell phones? God don't have to give us the power. My cat's trying to do the carpet. I'm doing like this to the carpet. But what I'm saying is, guys, that's the reason why God didn't give us the power. Because he knows we will screw up and do something wrong with it. Because he knows what we will do. He would know we will bring back our loved ones. He knows we would, there will be no people in heaven if we had his power. That's the reason why 
God hasn't given us the powers. His powers. But people say that he give gives somebody. People say somebody has a healing power. That could be true. Possibility true. He gives certain people that he trusts to give them healing powers. That could be true. But guys, I hope y'all enjoyed the video. That's the reason why God hasn't given us his powers. Because there will be chaos in this world. There will be no humans on in heaven because we bring back our loved ones that's the reason why God hasn't given us the power but guys I hope y'all enjoyed the video what do y'all think if God give y'all my zombie squad the power leave a comment down below that what will y'all would do with God's power I would like like to hear what y'all have to say. But guys, thanks for watching. Please hit the like button. And Dustin signing off on YouTube.